because astronomers have hit the jackpot. This is their dream come true. A new chapter in astronomy has opened up. Uh, Proxima Centauri b is an Earth-like planet that circles around the closest star to the planet Earth. What a coincidence. A new era in astronomy has begun. The discovery of Proxima Centauri b, an Earth-like planet orbiting the closest star to our solar system, has electrified the scientific community. Proxima Centauri b lies within the habitable zone of its star, where conditions might just be right for liquid water to exist. But what makes this discovery even more remarkable is the potential for this planet to be more hospitable to life than Earth itself. This notion of superhabitable worlds, planets that could offer even better conditions for life than Earth, challenges our understanding of what it means to be a habitable world. Could there be planets out there that are not just habitable, but supremely so? Let's embark on a journey to explore these fascinating worlds and the possibilities they hold for humanity's future. For centuries, humanity has looked up at the stars and wondered if we are alone in the universe. The discovery of exoplanets, planets orbiting stars outside our solar system, has fueled speculation that there might be other worlds out there teeming with life. But as we search for Earth-like planets, some scientists have begun to ask a provocative question. What if we found a planet that was even more suitable for life than Earth? The idea of superhabitable planets is gaining traction among astronomers who believe that these worlds could offer a better environment for life to thrive. But what exactly makes a planet superhabitable, and how would it differ from Earth? The concept of superhabitable planets was first proposed in 2014 by astrobiologists Rene Heller and John Armstrong. They argued that Earth, while a prime example of a habitable world, might not be the best possible habitat for life. Instead, there could be planets that offer conditions even more conducive to the emergence and evolution of life. These planets might have more stable climates, richer ecosystems, and longer periods during which life could develop. To identify these superhabitable worlds, Heller and Armstrong suggested looking for planets that meet a specific set of criteria, including the type of star they orbit, their age, their size, and their distance from their star. One of the key factors in determining a planet's habitability is the type of star it orbits. Our Sun is a yellow dwarf star, but there are other types of stars that could offer better conditions for life. For example, orange dwarf stars, also known as K-dwarfs, are smaller and cooler than the Sun, but have much longer lifespans. While the Sun has a lifespan of about 10 billion years, orange dwarf stars can burn for up to 70 billion years. This extended lifespan means that planets orbiting these stars would have more time for life to develop and evolve. Additionally, orange dwarf stars are more stable than the Sun, with fewer intense solar flares that could strip away a planet's atmosphere or damage potential life forms. Another important factor in a planet's habitability is its age. Earth is about 4.5 billion years old, and complex life has only emerged relatively recently in our planet's history. A superhabitable planet might be slightly older than Earth, between 5 and 8 billion years old, giving life more time to develop. However, a planet that is too old could lose its geothermal activity and magnetic field, which are essential for maintaining a stable climate and protecting the planet from harmful cosmic radiation. Therefore, there is a sweet spot in terms of age where a planet would have the ideal conditions for life. Size and mass also play a crucial role in a planet's habitability. A superhabitable planet would likely be slitely larger than Earth, with a greater surface area to support diverse ecosystems. A planet with 1.5 times the Earth's mass would have stronger gravity, which could help it retain a thicker atmosphere, providing better protection against cosmic radiation and helping to regulate the planet's climate. 
this stronger gravity would also allow the planet to hold onto its water for longer periods, preventing it from losing this vital resource to space. Additionally, a larger planet would have more volcanic activity, which could contribute to a richer atmosphere and more complex ecosystems by cycling nutrients through the environment. One of the most critical factors in determining a planet's habitability is the presence of water. Earth is often called the Blue Planet because of its vast oceans, which cover about 71% of its surface. Water is essential for all known forms of life, and it plays a key role in regulating our planet's climate. A superhabitable planet would likely have even more water than Earth, with a higher percentage of its surface covered by oceans, lakes, and rivers. This abundance of water would create more opportunities for life to emerge and diversify, as aquatic environments are often the most biodiverse on Earth. Moreover, a superhabitable planet might have a more temperate climate, with warmer average temperatures that would allow for more extensive tropical and subtropical regions. These regions are typically the most biodiverse on Earth, supporting a wide variety of plant and animal life. In addition to having more water, a superhabitable planet might also have a more complex and varied landscape. On Earth, mountains, valleys, plains, and other geological features create diverse habitats that support a wide range of life forms. A superhabitable planet could have even more varied topography, with larger mountain ranges, deeper valleys, and more extensive plains. This diversity of habitats would provide more niches for life to occupy, leading to greater biodiversity. Furthermore, a planet with more landmass might support larger continents with more stable climates, reducing the likelihood of extreme weather events that could threaten life. While the search for superhabitable planets is still in its early stages, astronomers have already identified several candidates. One of the most promising is Kepler 442b, an exoplanet located about 1,200 light years from Earth in the constellation Lyra. Kepler 442b is about 1.3 times the size of Earth and orbits within the habitable zone of its star, a K dwarf. This planet receives about two-thirds of the sunlight that Earth does, making it slightly cooler but still potentially habitable. Kepler 442b is also older than Earth, giving life more time to develop. While we don't yet know if Kepler 442b has water or an atmosphere, its size, age, and location make it a strong candidate for a superhabitable world. Another intriguing candidate is Ko. I-5715.01, an exoplanet located about 2,965 light years from Earth. KOI 5715.01 orbits an orange dwarf star and has a surface temperature slightly lower than Earth's. Its age falls within the ideal range for habitability, and its location in the habitable zone of its star suggests that it could have liquid water. If KOI 5715.01 has a thicker atmosphere than Earth, it could potentially support life. However, like Kepler 442b, we still need more information about this planet's composition and environment to determine if it is truly superhabitable. The discovery of superhabitable planets raises exciting possibilities for the future of humanity. If we could find a planet that is more suitable for life than Earth, it could become a new home for our species. But getting to one of these planets would be an enormous challenge. The closest star system, Alpha Centauri, is about 4.37 light years away, and the fastest spacecraft we have ever built would take tens of thousands of years to reach it. However, new propulsion technologies such as light sails or nuclear fusion, could potentially reduce the travel time to just a few decades. 
If we could develop the technology to reach these distant worlds, we might be able to establish colonies on superhabitable planets, ensuring the survival of humanity in the event of a global catastrophe on Earth. In the meantime, astronomers will continue to search for superhabitable planets using advanced telescopes and other technologies. The James Webb Space Telescope, set to launch in the coming years, will be able to analyze the atmospheres of exoplanets in greater detail than ever before, searching for signs of water, oxygen, and other key indicators of habitability. Additionally, the European Space Agency's PLATO mission and NASA's Louvoir Space Observatory will help identify and study new exoplanets, bringing us closer to finding a superhabitable world. These missions will not only expand our understanding of the universe, but also help us identify potential targets for future space exploration. While the idea of superhabitable planets is still relatively new, it has the potential to revolutionize our search for life beyond Earth. Instead of focusing solely on finding Earth-like planets, Astronomers are beginning to broaden their search to include planets that could offer even better conditions for life. By identifying and studying these superhabitable worlds, we may uncover new insights into the factors that make a planet suitable for life and increase our chances of finding extraterrestrial life. Moreover, the discovery of a superhabitable planet could provide humanity with a new goal to explore and colonize these distant worlds, ensuring the survival and flourishing of our species for generations to come. The search for superhabitable planets is not just about finding a backup for Earth. It is about expanding our horizons and exploring the incredible diversity of worlds that exist in our galaxy. Each new discovery brings us closer to answering some of the most profound questions about our place in the universe. Are we alone? Or is life a common occurrence on planets throughout the cosmos? Could there be other civilizations out there living on superhabitable planets that are even more advanced than our own? The answers to these questions could reshape our understanding of the universe and our place within it. As we continue to explore the stars, the possibility of finding a superhabitable planet offers a tantalizing glimpse of what the future might hold. These worlds could be the key to unlocking the secrets of life in the universe and securing humanity's future among the stars. The journey to find and explore these planets will be long and challenging, but the potential rewards are beyond imagination. If we can rise to the challenge, the discovery of a superhabitable world could be the next great leap for humanity, opening up new possibilities for exploration, discovery, and survival in the vast expanse of the cosmos.